everyone, and welcome back to the Adventures of Jacoby. I am, of course, Zach the Winter Warlock here with Storm Gaming Alliance for another episode in Skyrim. Welcome back, everyone. On the last episode, we, uh, well, we explored another black book, Untold Legends, I believe. Uh, we got the boon, traveled back here uh, to Raven Rock. Um, so we've got a steward that we found for Neloth, so I think think maybe we're at a point where we can head back to tell Mithrin if we wanted to. Not sure if that's what we're going to get into today, but um, yeah, let's get into it nonetheless. All right, so here we are just outside of um, Raven Rock, yes. Uh, we talked to a guy uh, who was very eager to become a steward um, over in Tel Mithrin. Um, <clears throat> And if I look, I believe that's where our quest marker is probably telling us to go right now. Yep. Um, so let's see. We found a steward and we did the lost knowledge. We still haven't heard back from that. So that takes care of all of that. Um, return the folio to Sindiri. The folio to Sindiri. Hmm. Sindiri Arano. Like, I mean, I guess, I don't know what that is, but we can look around for Sindiri. With the nope. Ashborn threat nope. taken care of, nope. I can give my men... No, you're not, Sindiri. Are you Sindiri? Nope. How about you? Nope. How about you? Your actions nope. here have been... How about you? Nope. Uh, Sindiri, Sindiri, Sindiri. I don't know, are you in the Retching Netch, maybe? If you're looking for the East... Sindiri. Sindiri, Sindiri, Sindiri. I don't even remember what this is all about. I think we found like a random notebook or something somewhere. I can't remember. I work for Mogul. You got a problem, you talk uh, to him. No, Slitter. What a weird name. Sindiri, Sindiri, Sindiri. I'm looking for Sindiri. Nope, you're Geldris. Where would Sindiri be? You know what I could do? Which is what I'm going to have to do. Um, show on the map. They're in Raven Rock. But apparently not inside the Retching Netch. I hate this guard so much. He always just follows me in here and then stands and blocks the door. Completely useless. Sindiri. Sindiri. I feel like I should know that name, but I definitely don't. Oh, they're in the... Okay. In Morvane Manor. Alright, we haven't been in to see Counselor Morvane in quite some time. Just want to get this quest list cleared up a bit. I think it's about time. We're going to go back. Except wild gnaws and ash wastes. Yeah. Sindiri Arano. You look able to venture outside of town. Perhaps you could help me recover something precious that was lost? Uh, yeah. You mentioned that you lost something? A few months ago, I had sent an important folio to the first edition bookshop in the Imperial City to be rebound. They sent it back to me recently, but it never arrived. Well, of course. Actually, I already have it. Mafala, bless you. You found it. Well, you've certainly proven your worth around here to me. Please accept this gift as a token of my appreciation. Ring of Magicka. Good journey, traveler. Uh. Okay. Okay. A ring of magicka, completely and absolutely beyond a shadow of a doubt, super duper useless. All right. Well, I guess. Actually, you know what we should probably do? Uh, let me look. Nah, we're okay. I was going to say we should probably get rid of a bunch of stuff, but to be honest with you, I don't think you guys want to see me go back into the house and unload my inventory. 
and I don't really feel like pausing the recording and forgetting to <laughs> edit it later. Um, so we're just gonna not worry about it. We're just gonna not worry about it. Yes, we're gonna go past um, Colbjorn Barrow here, but we're not gonna mess with anybody here. We have not received word from a courier. So as far as we know, there's nothing going on different here. Yeah, it looks like they've got a few people out here working. If they couldn't hold off the Draugr, who can? Who? Yeah, there's Rollis. It's Rollis's problem now. Okay. Yeah, I don't I don't think we received any word to talk to Rollis yet, so we're not even gonna mess around with Colbjorn Barrow. So one thing that we do have to figure out here, I think the next big set of quests, or the big, next big thing, um, as far as exploration is concerned, I think we're gonna have to do some, um, I think we're gonna have to hunt down some Dwemer ruins. Um, we need these Kagramez resonance gems. Um, and we've done nothing with that for the, well, like ever. Um, so I believe, you know, we'll get over here to tell Mithrin. We'll talk to Neloth. We'll do all that. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see what's going on with him. Um, but then I'm thinking, yeah, we'll probably start trying to focus on, uh, seeing if we can gather up some Kagrames resonance gems. Sort of getting down to the end of things here in Solstheim. That is a terrible waterfall texture over there. Let's just look at it. Yep, gross. Um, but yeah, I think we are um, approaching a point in time here where we're going to be getting ready to head back home. There's uh, really only a few more things that I care to take care of um, here in Solstheim as far as interesting quests. Getting Neloth taken care of is, of course, one of them. Uh, we have that miscellaneous quest about reading Neloth's black book, so I'd like to get that gone off the list, which is why we've been doing all this stuff for Neloth over the past episode or two. So, yeah, just trying to wrap up a few loose ends here um, so that we can start thinking about heading back home starting up chapter seven of the adventures of Jacoby. Um, yeah, I'm not even going to get into what we may or may not get into when we get home because we have no idea what the state of affairs is in Skyrim right now. So kind of difficult to say what kind of adventures we will find ourselves getting into. But one thing's for certain. Neloth. Back so soon? I found you a new steward. That Drovus man? I suppose he'll do. He makes dreadful Canis root tea, though. I teach him. But I should be grateful. Here, take this for your efforts. Oh, boy. Oh, and you may use my staff enchanter if you want. Okay, 500 gold. And the staff enchanter. Which is right here. Um, which, you know, is, it's a thing. Let me just click on it. Go through the tutorial. Oh, no, it doesn't say. Um, oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Requires Hearthstone and Unenchanted Destruction Staff. Yeah, so I don't think we have any Unenchanted Staves around here. Um, but there's the black book. Uh, let me go talk to Neloth about the black book that he had us look at first. Curse these heart stones. I have the black book. Excellent. I'll just make a copy for myself. It's far too dangerous to carry the real book around. Of course you can handle yourself. Of course you can. Of course. Now, take this for your efforts, and we'll call the matter closed. A thousand gold. Cool. Um. Are we done? 
I thought so. Okay, so let's just see if in fact we are done. Colby Orm Barrow. That's all stuff from Skyrim. Um, what we're actually working on here is the black book in the tower, which we know is right here. Should we just read it? I guess that's what we came here for. I mean, we're doing two black books back to back, but... Oh, I get to take his black book? Hmm. I guess we'll find out. Yep, and then we have to deal with the random freeze, going from third person back to first person. There we go. The Hidden Twilight. Learn the book's hidden knowledge. Okay. Alright, that's weird. So that probably opens that up. Yep. Just a little alcove. I'm gonna check out the other side of this alcove as well. See if there's anything... Ooh, look at this. I imagine we can't go terribly far. Oh, we absolutely can. Although I don't think I can get over there without using Whirlwind Sprint. And we're not too concerned. Alright, let's hit the scry and um, open up this door. Cool. Onward to chapter two. Yes. Yes. Chapter two. Sweet. Alright, so far so easy. Although it seems like the first chapter is always a throwaway chapter. Okay. That's how we return to chapter one. We don't need a font of magicka. Okay. Tell you what, I'll be excited to be done with the black books. This looks like a place where the Seekers would hide. Okay. Oh yeah, there's one right there. is going to be one that has to like unfold everywhere. Great. Alright, where's that seeker over there? Anything around this thing? Nope. Oh good, there's two of them. Um, I mean, I guess there really isn't much to it but to do it. I don't know that I'm going to be able to sneak up on anybody. Yeah, he turned around. Let's see if we can sneak up on him. Nope. There we go. Ugh. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah, empty ash pile. Why are you even bothering searching that? Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. But, uh, you know. But now what? Oh. This way, presumably. Oh, okay, so that's just where we came in from. And now if we hit the scry... 
this thing is going to unravel like a cartoon dog's tongue. Yep. Excellent. Oh, it just wiggles up and down. Okay. There we go. We made it. Jump. 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 Sweet. That was a cool little thing. Alright, so there's a left and a right. I'm sure there's plenty of death and destruction down there. Oh, wait. This is chapter three? Yep. Alright, well, okay. We have to go to the other side first. Just a couple of gems that we don't care about and a font of magicka that we also don't care about. Okay. Sounds like there's walking, but I'm just gonna just gonna beat feet. Cool. Chapter three. Let's get on with it. I hate how freezy the black books are. It always makes me very nervous because Skyrim is unstable as it is. It doesn't need any help. See, does this just wrap around? Yep. Okay. Cool. You. There's a. There's a seeker right there. Okay. That goes nowhere. But we'll check out this pod. Yeah. Sure. All right. So, what do you think? Should I just lob an arrow that direction just to see what happens? Let's do it. Why not? draw, zoom in, release. Okay, maybe not. I was expecting it to know exactly where I was. And release. And release. All right. Okay, that's cool, I guess. What? Wait a minute. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Stand up. Is this gonna open the staircase? Yes, it does. Okay, so that's the up from here. Then that released this staircase. For us to get up over here. Probably nothing to write home about. Um, nope. Yeah, some soul gems and stuff. Nothing that I really care about too much. All right. Don't whip at me. Oh, sugar. Fire resistance or some such nonsense. And kneecaps. Good job, Jacoby. Kill that giant fish man looking craziness. Uh, yep, and sure. All right, now where were we? So we came in that way. We apparently can't open that door. Uh, we come around this side and there's precisely nothing. Come around this side. few things around this side. Ah, there's chapter four. We're not quite ready for that yet. Um, so let's go, man, the labyrinthine maze here. Is this, yeah, we came up there. No, we didn't. Ah, 
Aha, there we go. So that opened that door for us. Break a leg. So we know the book for chapter four is back there. Hmm. That opens that door. Okay. So let's climb back down. And then I guess we go up in here. Oh, crap. Alright. I don't know why there was a seeker back here. Is there treasure? I am lost. Oh. Okay. I'm very confused. Here's more books. Chapter five and six. Well, that's not quite right. Oh boy, I'm lost in here, guys. Um. Okay, is this how I got up here? Yeah. And then... That doesn't go anywhere. This... Doesn't go anywhere. That wraps around. This wraps around. Yeah, there's the long hallway. That wrapped around through there. This wrapped around through here. Where was that chapter four book? Was it back in here? Was it up over here? No, I thought this was just to activate that scry, right? Yeah. Um. I'm confused. Where? Where was that chapter four book? So we came over here. here. Well, if we go up these steps, yeah, that goes up top. This goes nowhere. Okay, what about this one? That goes nowhere. That loops around right where we just were. Oh, there it is. Okay. Chapter four. Let's check out chapter four. There's chapters four, five, and six all on this level. That was, that was a little bit confusing. Okay. That's interesting. resistant or something. So that does not open any door except letting them around. Okay. So it's back to chapter three. Man, we're running long on this episode, but I kind of don't want to pick back up in this black book. So this might be a little bit longer of an episode than we're used to. Okay, so now 
I need to get out of here. And I need to go up. That seeker is still mad at me, but it's way over there. So I'm not too concerned. We go up and up and up, right? And we go this way. Go this way. Yeah, this is the one that extended. Because they've got these weird little glowy lights. Then, okay, so we've gone in chapter 4. So now we have to go into chapter 5. It'll probably just be to fight that other seeker. Which is fine, but... Okay, then we can open this one. Oh. Okay, well let's put the sword away so we can see. Before the ages of man, breathing water, Racial phylogeny, hypothetical treachery. I think the only one we don't have is breathing water. So we'll take that one. But I know we have... Yeah, we definitely have that one. Before the Ages of Man. Yep, because a lot of those I've already read for... Um, Jacoby's Library. Bingo. That's it. That's all we need from here. That doesn't go any further. We can't, you know, we can't go in there at all. That was chapter four back there. Okay, back to chapter three. Then to chapter six. And we should be pretty much done, I think. So, chapter six. <clears throat> Don't freeze. Okay, one thing we're going to do... Okay, apparently we don't have an autosave ready for us yet. I'm gonna sneak for just a second. I don't know why, I just kinda had a instinctual button press there. Oh, what's up here? Nothing. Towers of books. Okay. Chapter eight. Chapter seven. Okay. Golly, this is a long book. And a very confusing one. I forgot that Neloth's black book was a pain in the balls. Hello. No, get out of my way. It's the real one that I want. Uh, a level up. It's about damn time. Uh, no, no. No, no, no. All right. That did something somewhere else. Yes. That did something somewhere else. Right? Right. Okay. See, like, how stupid was that? Bethesda. Like, I love your game, I really, really do, but what the actual? I didn't need to do that. I had to go into a book to hit a button to come back. Ugh, 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 whatever. Whatever, whatever. Oh, crap. Seekers are everywhere. Just die. Far, far away from me, please. Alright, so that's circled around. We're gonna grab our black soul gem. And that's all we need from that side. Let's go to this side, see if there's anything cool. No. What about over here? No. Alright, so we have to go out. I'm betting that the scry we hit over there did this. Yep. Alright. 
Ooh, there's two of them. I wonder, do we have any kind of fun po poisons at all? Uh, frostbite venom. You know what? Let's see how immune to poison they are. bridge. Get off the bridge. I'd rather fight them down here. I don't want to get knocked off. Alright, fine. Whatever. Run past. damage or anything, but they're just large and annoying. Oh, now I'm staggered on the floor. Alright, let's check you before you fall over. Yep. What about you? Necklace of rejuvenation. Sure. Now what? No, but seriously, now what? Oh, there's a scry right there. But yeah, that's not cool, because they've got these whippy tendril boys right there and right here. So you got to fight two lurkers and tendrils all at the same time. Rude. Uh, finally. Finally. All right, let's check the vessel. Mm-hmm. Black Soul Gem, Black Soul Gem. Scroll of Paralyze, that's pretty cool. Ebony Flesh, also pretty cool. Alright, read the Black Book, The Hidden Twilight. Alright, let's see what our options are going to be this time. We have Mora's Agony, Mora's Grasp, Mora's Boon. So, Mora's Agony is, summons a field of writhing tentacles that poisons foes. Mora's Grasp, freezes the target between Oblivion and Tamriel for 30 seconds, making them immune to all damage. No, that, no. Fully restore your health, magicka, and stamina. Yep. We've got all kinds of ac active powers now. Bardic Knowledge to help regain stamina. Bones of the Earth. Oh yeah, that's a single use from the Earth Stone. Morris Boon. North Wind. Oh yeah. Yep. Um, Alright, back to Solstheim. Cool. I am going to say that we're done until Mithrin. I don't know. Yep, and we have his black book now. Oh, frozen. Come on. Unfreeze. Thank goodness. Okay. Um, so we took his black book. I hope, what does he care? Curse these heart stones. Uh, nope. Yeah, whatever you say. I'm actually just going to come back in this room. Get the, uh, there we go, Staff Enchanter in the background. And I think this is where we should probably leave off for today. Well, everybody, thanks for hanging out with me here on this episode of The Adventures of Jacoby. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. And of course, if you're not already subscribed, be sure to hit that subscribe button so you can stay current on all things SGA. We are just a couple weeks away from dropping season two of our homebrew D&D campaign, Mechanical Rain. So you'll definitely want to check that out when that comes. Um, as always, I am active down in the comments. I'd love to get to talk to you guys, so feel free to stop down there below and say hi. And, um, yeah, that's all I have for you, folks. Thanks again for hanging out, and I will see you all on the next episode.